So I'm an early bird. I love having more time and the headspace in my day to do things. I journal, I make coffee, and I talk to friends back at home. This is just an average day working in tech media. If you're interested in what it's like being an expat in Singapore, don't forget to subscribe to follow along. This is my work setup, everyone. Just kidding. Uh, no, I had a few calls and I'm currently watching this video on Angel Investing 101 because I was inspired by my two friends and just want to learn more. So today I'm going to be going to Sam's place because she has better coffee and she actually has a real Nespresso machine. Whereas for me, I have instant coffee <laughs> and I'm just going to go all the way to her place to use her machine and hang out and just do some work there because I just need good quality coffee. I guess this one. Yay. Wow, it's so fancy. Yes, I will make one. Three jazz swimmer. Actually, is there any water in there? Yep. Yeah. This is like Sam's coffee shop. Not Sam's coffee shop. <laughs> Or what? I guess. <laughs> Do we even know what we're making? <laughs> no. Okay. <I> don't... <laughs> and then I take the bus to grab some lunch before my meetings. On the way, I saw that there was the Chinese Zodiac exhibition, so I checked it out. Good thing to see my career is good and full swing. Wealth, making me a lot of money, always a good sign. Romance, eh. Because I work in the startup space, I meet a lot of founders, and today I was meeting at Found8. While I had the time, I was just working on interviews that I had already completed, and I decided to stick around for a few hours just because the space was really nice. I usually have five meetings per day. If you're curious, I interview a lot of entrepreneurs, CEOs, executives within the VC and startup space. I'll link it in the captions below. And then generally, I'm in Asana, project managing a few campaigns and new segments. This is honestly a godsend. Then I normally grab another cup of coffee. Less sweet. I generally work out of the office every Monday and Wednesdays, and this is kind of what the space looks like. The space itself has a very homey feel. In our fridge, as you can see, we have a lot of beers and cold brews. I am a beer drinker, so sometimes I'll have a nice beer after work. I'm also really fond of walking, so if we have events at night, I tend to walk to wherever I need to go at the end of the day. We also host these learning nights at Crane Club, which is an event partner of ours. We started this new initiative at work called Oasis Learning Nights. We bring in speakers from our community to teach us something new, outside the scope of work. It happens once a month and it's a really great way to meet new people. I hop on the bus and head home. And then generally at night, I'm journaling, working on personal admin projects or my personal OKRs, lighting the candle, having a nice glass of wine, and just winding down. It looks like I have lipstick on because of the spice. My lips are on fire. Fuck. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. See you soon.